Hi, I'm Jarley. Welcome to my channel. This is going to be a reading for Leo, all aspects and all the cross watcher from when you see it up until the middle of September. So remember, this is a general reading. Take what resonates with you. The rest, if this doesn't resonate with you, check other aspects of your chart. Could well be that they resonate more for you. If you want a personalised reading, information is in the description box below. Let's get started. For the Leos, spirit, what exactly can the Leos be expected to see from the beginning of September till the middle of September, please? Hmm. <clears throat> okay, so someone's been worried very recently. It could even be some reoccurring energy where you're still worried <clears throat> there's fears being released here but it's like you're so you're a little bit more focused so there could have been fear and worry you're moving out of but you could be now sort of trying to persevere to get to where you want to go here let's see what else we can pick up for you guys spirit for leos what else is going on from beginning to the middle of september for Leo, what else is happening here for Leo? <coughs> okay then, got a lot going on then. Nearly, nearly knocked me out. <clears throat> oh wow, wow. Right, so you could have been feeling very tied down or very frustrated. Okay, um, I don't. I think this has got. Is that off for a horse? I don't know. Why do I feel like this is? for a horse someone please correct me in the comments if i'm wrong with that um it's like a workhorse it's like you've it's like you're being untethered and you're going your own way here because look we've got the star guaranteed success this is you going your own way with success possibly even because your psychic abilities are that enhanced from what you've gone through it's like you've gone through this process of being refined a refinement process where it's like whatever's created or happened has broken it's like a regenerational tool it's like you're you're getting upgrades that's how i want to say it you're getting you're up you're getting upgraded so you've turned that fear now into focus possibly and the worry is just until you see the outcome um, you could even be learning that worry doesn't change the outcome, but there's a perseverance energy to you here that you're utilising. Yeah, you're stepping out of this energy. There's a new energy that's being presented to you. <laughs> With victory. You're having victory. This is V for victory here. Okay. You need to make a decision though, right? Especially if you've been indecisive about a situation. Especially if you've been frustrated. There was a lesson that has to be learned on your path before you can proceed. And again, this could be leading into a new job or career here, all right? Could be getting advice from a friend as well that's um, asking you to look in, into this certain things that maybe you hadn't done already. All right, let's see what else. Okay, what else please for Leo's? What else for the Leos, please? What other energy for the Leo, please? Between now and the middle of September. What else for the Leos? Yeah, look, lifting yourself out of negativity. <clears throat> wow. Okay. So there's, okay, let's have a look. So you've got some kind of resilience that's being built up. Let me get some, um, what other cards for Leo's we need to look into here? What else is happening for Leo energy? Wow. Between now and the middle of September. What's going on for the Leo's, please? You're breaking free of something here. You're breaking free of something. Yep. Okay, let's see. What is this then? Right. What is the hummingbird for Leo's? So 
something they're talking about a missed up you feel like there was a missed opportunity it could have been a blessing i don't know if it was a missed opportunity it looks more like a blessing right what else what else what's going on for the right what is the garden what's the crow what is the heart wow and what's the rider <clears throat> someone had to disconnect from a situation real quick it's like you had to absolutely backtrack and leave a situation um you could have ghosted a situation or ghosted someone they could have mm, they could have ghosted you you could have done it after a response from what someone else did it's like you had to do that as a maybe self-preservation and now maybe you're coming into this period where it's like you're now kind of thinking okay what do i need to wrap up here what do I, what is the truth it's like you this was always going to happen that there was a distant there was a, a lack of alignment here it was always built for you to it was kind of a test for you to kind of acknowledge what is for you and what isn't really um whatever it was you were expecting to move forward with this connection and it, it fell apart and that was because someone was not being they were not being honest someone was not being honest in the situation i feel like this is something that's already happened it's like you you didn't trust from that you didn't then trust the signals because you were like well what's real and what isn't what is going on here you know and it's but i feel like you're coming out of that i don't feel like this is and if this is not something you've gone into maybe this is something you're hitting against at the moment right but it feels like you are coming out of a cycle that was particularly hard because it was like it, it was disorientating what is going what is going to happen for the leo energy please between now and the middle of september leo energy please yeah it's like this was done to remove obstacles because it, it would have led you into a longer journey and i feel like you whatever's about to come in you couldn't have that as a distraction there is going to be a full moon on yeah because it'll be the full full moon so at the end of the month there's going to be a reveal as to why this has to happen um but i feel like it's not going to be what you expect what is this expect the unexpected so it's like you're you're it's like you're gaining in information between now and the middle of september as to what all this was about um okay let's see what else we can pick up from here right what what is happening please between now and the middle of september for the leos yeah it's whatever track you were on was again it had to it had to teach you that there was a more balanced way of doing it, it, it there, there was a rerouting here you were rerouted for a reason that was for you to gain clarity on something but also gain to gain something else it could be to test to see if this is actually really what you wanted all right but it's like whatever information you're getting through between now and the middle of the month it's designed to make you question everything so that you, at the end of it you don't go well i kind of wish i hadn't gone down that route now because it's like they're, they're reiterating are you sure you want this this is basically what they're asking what else please for the leos they're making sure you get what you deserve 
This is not about what you want. They're asking, they're making sure you get what you deserve. Not what people think you deserve, what spirit knows you deserve. Not what people are going to breadcrumb you into believing is going to be the right thing for you. What you actually deserve. So they're looping this back around for a reason. All right, what else can we... Yeah, especially if this threw you for a loop and it was like there was... You're worrying that someone was against you. So, first of all, don't give anyone that power. <laughs> That's your Leo. <laughs> like, what are you doing? <laughs> Do not let anyone take your energy. And that involves, again, this is not just about spiritual, this is the mental as well. Don't let anyone take or make you believe. Like, because this is the thing. Spirit would have put that into your path to realign you with something, not to punish you or to make you doubt yourself this is about remember this is the fear overcoming that fear overcoming that worry and the perseverance to actually get you to where you want to go so it's like they're stripping the bare bones of you here building your core up right to get you to where you need to be to get you into abundance this is announcement bell but it's also about a, an energy because the bell clears isn't it if you ring a bell it's about a clearance of negative energy this is to strip you so that again yeah look pale time to get out of a situation so whatever kind of energy you were in alignment with with this old situation spirit had to remove that could have happened in july could have it started off in july in leo season and you're sat there thinking this was supposed to be my time to shine it could have been the time to act around that point and so again they had to re it, it's like they're rebuilding you but they're doing it and again you might sit there and go listen this was awful for me i went through hell this is not uh you know enjoyable okay but the blessings you get at the end of it will be so that if they're putting you through some kind of initiation because it's like you have to get this ability or this energy or this awareness or there was some part of you that had to learn something to get to where they're taking you I don't think you're at the end of this going to sit there and go, why did you do this? I think you're going to be sat there thinking, oh my goodness, this makes sense. Because this is a tr this is a trust exercise. Do you trust spirit or not? Especially if you're spiritual. Do you trust them? Because if you don't, look, club, someone will try and make you do something against your will. So especially if you're being talked out of your own power... This is going to be great for people who want you to, to not succeed because it's like you're handing them an opportunity. Don't let, even if you've been put through the paces here, what? <laughs> do you know what I mean? Like, don't hand that to them on a silver platter and be like, well, you know, like obviously I kind of deserved it. This, this is an upgrade that you're getting, which means you've done the work, right? If, if for those of you that resonate with this, there's upgrades coming, but they have to refine you. There's no point. It's like a test run. They're seeing who's around, making sure you know who's around you. So when you get your abundance, you're not flooding, allowing all these people to flood in. Um, yeah, look, casket, someone is going out of your life or the end of a situation. They're trying to get you to see what can't come with you, all right, into this next level. And again, you're climbing towards this success. You're climbing towards this success. They have to fine tune, refinement because not everything can reach that vibration especially that high vibration of love right not that you can see that but apparently the light is ref <laughs> thanks spirit that was very well demonstrated that we need to be able to read the card at this point <laughs> your pure white orb of light is going to <laughs> right hang on okay we get it we get it this is thank you spirit for demonstrating okay so that says love the lights just recently changed so this could also involve who you're meant to be not that you can see that this could also involve who you're meant to be with it says marriage again they're putting you into a, an alignment that is beneficial for your soul growth right not to make you feel like you don't you're not worthy of anything to actually make you feel like you've done the right thing right what else please for the leos what do the leos need to know 
again, it's to put you through healing. It's to put you through some kind of healing exercise because again, we know how when we're kind of doing healing or if we're put through a situation that requires healing, it helps you upgrade your energy, right? It doesn't always feel great, but it is beneficial for your spiritual growth and this is what your soul's come here to, to learn, you know? And it's to help you raise your vibration to get you to the next level it's to help you with your craft to help you with your abundance this light is, is brilliant but uh, <laughs> it doesn't help me with the cards so that says raise your vibration so this is what it's it's aimed to do it doesn't feel like that maybe you're losing friends family members but what are you gaining Right. right, let's see. Between now and the middle of September, Spirit, what is the final message for Leos? Yeah. Reveal your truth. Be yourself. Take off the mask. Maybe you've done your healing and you're ready to show you. But this is about time of reflection here. <coughs> so Virgo energy. This light is very annoying. Oh, wow. You can see absolutely nothing now. I know what they're trying to demonstrate. So this is about coming out of the darkness, right? I know that's a very cheesy way of analysing that, but th this light was not this intense, all right, before. So this is a time... <laughs> uh, this is a time to reflect, okay? Can you see there's a mirror image of the, of the two faces here? It's to help you. It, they are taking all the, the like distractions from you so you can understand the next phase because whatever you need to do in the next phase you need to do it in an authentic manner take the mask off share your thoughts be present be be confident with what you know especially if someone was telling you you shouldn't be right final message i've just seen 1717 on the clock leo's final message please this is about discovery of you as well okay so not to have anything and this is your root chakra energy so grounding this is security. This is about your abundance and what you've come here to do. To help you get into balance for the next stage, okay? This is balance. So this is to help you balance everything out and to get you into position. Let me do a final card here for the Leos. Last message for Leo Spirit. Final message for the leos the dragonfly so this is abundance this is change this is healing this is adaptability this is a strong blessing look up dragonfly that could be your, your animal totem or your a spirit guide spirit animal um, but the, especially if you're seeing dragonflies look out for that because it's it's reflecting change but it's also about the elements guiding and helping you, you guiding and helping you. Okay, Leo, hopefully that's some help. Thank you for your likes, your shares and your subscriptions. It means a lot to me. Until next time, take care.